today <clears throat> is the 20th of July. It's 8 a.m. and about 85 degrees. Um, we cut into some of these lemons and even though they were hard, they look like they're forming properly. So, um, we're leaving them alone. I think my husband cut into one of them that had a, that's turning yellow. So, the tree's gotten probably three times its size, which is amazing. I think the asparagus fern is doing good right there. The weather this week is going to be all in the hundreds. It's, I don't think we're going to have a day in July that doesn't, that wasn't over a hundred. So that's what we're dealing with. You can see things are crispy. I just can't be too concerned about anything because it is what it is. Cinnamon basil's pretty. It looks like from the 10 day forecast that we might go down to um, like five degrees, which would be quite the blessing. I think, ooh, looks like another, my balm bit the dust too. Lavender's doing good though. Gotta remember that. We looked for hornworms last night and found some. I will say the beds that have, oh, there's a hummingbird getting a drink. disturb them. I will say that the garden here, the garden beds that have the, the shade cloth on them have done the best. So I can't believe that this hyacinth bean took over and did all of this. <laughs> That's amazing to me. And I did see some blooms on it, but they're not spectacular blooms, so. I still, I'm waiting for some cantaloupe. And that's what this is down here, too. There's a cantaloupe. I don't know if you can see it. It's right in there. On the ground there. So, the cantaloupe is doing good. Awesome to see all these vines. 
husband took out that bed because it was pretty much dead and I have some um, cucumbers that I'll probably plant in there. I was going to plant something right here, but it's kind of being taken up with vines, so I don't know that I will do that. We shall see. I might be able to plant something in there. These eggplants are looking better. I pinched back my zinnias. And then I've got some pretty lemongrass. I really think the lemongrass is awesome. I haven't used any yet, but I intend to. Containers not doing so good this time of year but and tomatoes certainly don't like it this hot either I will probably plant some basil in this bed where there's tomatoes but I want to wait until the heats a little less so. these are not looking good of course they're all in container containers as well I don't know if I actually really even showed them Bougainvillea has a little bloom on the end of it. <laughs> That's my garden diary. Today is the 19th of July, and this is what we got out of the garden. This and three hornworms. So, and a lot of these are kind of on the, well, they I picked them as they were blushing because um, I couldn't trust, I had a lot of throwaways because of the, something was eating them, so, anyway, I guess that's not bad for the 19th of July when we've had no day that wasn't over 100, 